Hello friends, in this lecture we will continue with constraint and we will know about symmetry. So as the name suggests, symmetry means equal distance from a reference. So to understand this, I click on this fit view first and then I draw a rectangle. So click on this rectangle, pick this and I draw a rectangle like this from this point up to this point okay like this so i want to make this rectangle symmetric with respect to this vertical axis and this horizontal axis so to make it symmetric we have to use the symmetric constraint so it is really important type of constraint so to apply the symmetric constraint we need three references as we have discussed earlier so to select the three references suppose i want to make this rectangle symmetric with respect to vertical axis. So this is the cutting axis. It means we have to cut this horizontal line. Okay. So to cut this we need to select the vertical references. How to select this references? We have to hold down the control key. Select this first vertical line and then select the second vertical line. And then we have to select the reference. So reference is this vertical axis. Okay. So all these three lines should be in the same plane. And then we have to go to this constraint dialog box. In this right now we can see symmetry option is highlighting. So make a check on this. And now we can see the effect of symmetry. So I make a click on this. So now this rectangle is symmetric with respect to this vertical line. So the distance of this vertical line, left vertical line from this axis is equal to the distance from this right vertical line. So to see the effect of this, I make a undo of this. And right now we can see the position of this rectangle. So the distance is lesser on the left side and it is higher on the right side. When I redo this, redo this, and now we can see it is now equidistance. So when I change the length of this rectangle, I select this line, click on this dimension. It is now 30. So let's change this. Make a double click on this. So I make it 20 and press enter. And once again, we can see this rectangle is symmetric with respect to vertical axis. So that is the advantage of making it symmetric. Similarly, I want to make this symmetric with respect to horizontal axis. So for this, hold down the control key, select this first line, the second line, and then select this axis. Click on this constraint and then make it symmetric and click OK. So now we can see this rectangle is symmetric with respect to this horizontal axis. So to check it, I click on this line insert the dimension and then make a double click on this so i make it 15 and click ok so now we can see the distance is equal so that is called symmetric constraint